Hello everybody! Welcome back to The Walking Dead! Last time uh, we went into Clementine's house. She is the little girl that we found within this backyard. Uh, we had a bit of a problem with her babysitter, Sandra, who was a Zamboni, which was a problem at the time. Her body's disappeared, so there's that. But other than that, we are currently going out and about, hopefully to try and find some other people to help us out. Alright, just going to check around here. Do, do, do. Okay, look at the treehouse again, say goodbye to that. Bye bye treehouse! Bye bye tea set bye bye wheelbarrow, bye bye tire on a string! All right, let's pop out here. Yeah. Can't go back out there. No. All right, Lee. Come on, let's go then. <laughs> oh, sorry about being into the mic. If I do get a bit too loud sometimes, guys, I do apologize. I have a pretty shitty mic at the moment, so going to have to just deal with that. Oh, hello there. We seem to have some more people. Alright, Clint. Oh, man. I ain't never getting home to Mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. Yeah, it's hot dish night. My favorite night of the year. What are we gonna do? We're all screwed out now! Alright. Something wrong, What's Clem? The matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? Uh... I won't leave you alone. Yeah, I won't Let's leave you alone. somewhere safe that's close, okay? Okay. That's a good idea. Yep. Alright, let's get moving then. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're what? not gonna hurt you. It, it starts yeah. though you can reason with the dead. A you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. No. We, we need, need help. help. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things uh -huh. are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown Atlanta, 15 miles back. I'm Sean. Jeez. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. Sean Green, huh? I'm Chet. Just chat. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. Uh, it should be safe in there. I'm not a dad. I'm a... Honesty is the best policy, in my opinion. Just some guy. Yeah. Some guy? Yeah. yeah. She's alone? Hmm. Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. Very true. What do you want to do? I... Uh, the monsters come out. We gotta go. Oh shit! Quick, let's go. Okay. Fucking push the car. Move my car, sir, please. And punch that. And again. Hurry! The screen is getting red for no reason. Oh my god! Let's go. Let's go, let's go! Go, go, go! Roll out! For just some guy? Seems like you saved a bunch of lives today. Oh, thanks, Sean. By the way, if you choose to go at night, uh, Chet dies. He becomes a walker, so... Saved a life, I guess. And it's suddenly nighttime, full moon. Oh crap, we're gonna have werewolves about now. Hi. See, this is nice. No walkers about. Oh, farmland. Do, 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 do. Driving into the farm. Ooh. Nice plot of land. Hey, Sean, I'm gonna run on home. My mama's gonna be in a snit. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. 
And that was the last we, sh we saw of Chet. He shall be forever gone in the series. Thank God you're okay. I huh. was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Old Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. By the way, that's Herschel that. Green. He well, is from the comic now. books and the TV show. You've brought a couple guests. Mm-hmm. You're always a lifesaver. Glad yeah. to be a help to somebody. So you're welcome. just you and your daughter, then. Uh... No, not his daughter. He's, well, well, just some guy who found her alone. Yep. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay, then. Well, mm. looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Yep. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Alright then. Just gonna sit here. Okay. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Hmm. Could, Could be, be worse. worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? Uh, Lee. It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. Hey, Herschel. You die in How'd the TV happen? show and comics. Spoiler alert. Car accident. That's so. Where did mm -hmm. you get it? Before the car accident. I was getting out of the uh, The news says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. Yeah. Get a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about on the road. Who are you with, the girl? Uh, no, a police officer. I was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. I'm an awful nice guy. Yeah. Line, we got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. All you right. Daughter are welcome to rest there. And we're Wait. Here. But we just said she's not our daughter. Your name, darling. Clementine. She's not our daughter. I can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. Um, oh my god. Looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Yeah, see, not our daughter. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. Smart kid. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV uh, or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Yeah, someone's taken a massive shit on that fan. Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. <laughs> I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. You say that now, but... Teenage girl with a gut spilled out on the floor stood up from the dead and tried to bite me. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Well, Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We can, can I speak? It, really. Can you I give me a chance said, to speak? Okay. Shut up! Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. Thanks. If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. Oh. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. I'm not a horse. Well, I'm not. It, redress it, and you'll be fine. And you'll want to talk. Okay. You lose your legs. Both of them. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing. And you also, saying it's not necessary to tomorrow, reinforce your you fence. Towards making, I suppose. In the TV show and comic books, your place gets overrun by walkers. Walkers is what they call oh, zombies. Right. Hmm. Well. By the way, this is a lot smaller of a farm than in the TV show and comics. It smells like. Like. Well. Shit. <sighs> what? Well, shouldn't talk like. It this. is. It's shit. It's a swear. Yeah, but it's shit. That's what you call it. I miss my mom and dad. Hmm. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh. Yeah. Okay. It's not as if we're ever gonna get there in this season. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, night, night. Hmm. 
that I will explain later as the Let's Play progresses. But for now, you'll have to wait in mystery what Lee's nightmare was. Hey, get up. Kenny! <laughs> well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. My man. Well, I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm, uh, not her dad. Man like Ken. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of fence. There's a tractor Best up. and everything. He's worthless. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. Mm-hmm. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Duck? Duck? Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? That's uh, a valuable treat lately. No mm -hmm. kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hammers. Dad! But he makes up for it with enthusiasm. Meh. Still worthless. Word is, you were on your way to Macon. My yeah. family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Oh, we've bashed a poor teenage girl's head in, so yeah. Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Yeah. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. 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 That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. Yep. I want to build a fence. Yeah? You don't well, get to! For me. Smack! You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. <laughs> on the tractor? Cool! And I get to Except smack you whenever I feel like it. Like that. Duck. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Okay. That's not perverted at all. Alright. Well. This was a short part. <laughs> Alright guys, sorry about that. But that'll do for this part. Uh... You have such pretty hair. It gets lots of tangles. Okay then. Thank you for that comment, Katja and Clementine. Anyway, thank you all for watching this part. We're slowly but surely getting there. Uh, next episode will be a bit longer. So yeah. As, anyway, next time we shall check up on everyone around us. So Kenny, Katja, Dirk, Sean, Clementine, etc, etc. Our legs all better now. Look at that. We can walk properly. Alright. Daddy give you that hat? Mm -hmm. Do you two mind shutting the hell up? I'm trying to do an outro here. Yes, you two. The people I'm looking at. Except for you, Clem. You're, you're fine. She's asking you questions. You're being a good girl. Anyway, hopefully we shall be able to figure out what to do next. So... Oh. So, check on Kenny working on his truck, etc, etc. So, I shall hopefully see you guys next time on The Walking Dead, the video game. By Telltale Games. Do you have any pets? Uh, oh. I have a goldfish named Peanut. Mom doesn't like dogs. Oh, well, we have a lab named Franklin back in Fort Lauderdale. And that was an Easter egg. So I'm glad we got to wait until we could hear that easter egg. There's a fun little fact. They have a dog and Clementine had a fish named Peanut. Well, they both had pets. Sad things happen in this world. Anyway, I shall see you all next time!